After 75 years of service throughout the Midwest and the nation, Vandalia Bus Lines has proven its commitment to quality and excellence that was forged by Leon Strife, who purchased the company in 1975. With the invention of the first motorized horseless carriage in the late 1800s and the beginning of mass production of automobiles in the early part of the 19th century came the development of the motor coach. The Illinois Commerce Commission by definition stated that any motor vehicle carrying more than eight passengers would be called a bus. In 1932, the Illinois Commerce Commission authorized the purchase of a small bus line called the Blue Goose by the Vandalia Bus Company operating out of Vandalia, Illinois. This new venture was spearheaded by Lloyd B. Cady Calvin and four other businessmen from O'Fallon, Illinois. The new transportation company would service the towns of Collinsville, Fairmont City, and East St. Louis, along with the original routes that had been provided by the Blue Goose Company that included St. Louis and the Illinois towns of Troy, St. Jacobs, Highland, and Greenville. Lloyd Cady Calvin also began transporting local school students in 1934 using an 11 passenger Dodge that he called the Cady Motor Coach. The company grew slowly but steadily until it received a national charter approval on December 15, 1938. In 1939, Vandalia Bus Lines began to experience significant growth and change. With the advent of World War II and the need for military and defense transportation, the company moved its operation to Collinsville, Illinois, just nine miles from downtown St. Louis and in close proximity to Scott Air Force Base in Shiloh, Illinois. In 1944, the original five buses were augmented by the purchase of two new 29-passenger Ford coaches. The next 30 years saw the company continue to expand its fleet buying most of its 20 buses from General Motors. With routes throughout the Metro East area of Illinois and expanded areas in Missouri, Vandalia Bus Company became the largest privately owned transportation company operating in the St. Louis area. In 1975, another local businessman who was a visionary and who had himself been in the transportation business approached Vandalia with an offer to purchase the aging company. With the sale, the new owner, Leon Strife, would retain operating authorities along with seven buses and the main terminal, which was then located in Caseyville, Illinois. Mr. Strife had learned his trade as a mechanic. He had owned several Sinclair gas stations, a tavern called Club 50, and had been under contract with the Lebanon School District to provide bus service to its students for some time. Strife's bus company at that time was called Strife Bus Services. The first real motor coach bus Mr. Strife had owned was a 1951 GMC Silverside, which had been a Greyhound bus. In the beginning, Mr. Strife began to move the new company more and more into the charter coach business. His interest grew out of trips with friends and family that were taken on the Silver Side to the Grand Ole Opera in Nashville, Tennessee. Realizing the potential, he outfitted another used Greyhound coach that had an onboard restroom and began marketing group tours to Nashville. With the increased demand for charters, he acquired numerous other companies while continuing to upgrade his rolling stock. Through the 1980s, the company expanded to include the Gray Line franchise of St. Louis, which offers guided sightseeing tours throughout major cities around the world. Through the 1980s and into the 1990s, the company grew to include 62 buses with an operating staff of 120 employees with office and destination areas such as Lake of the Ozarks and St. Louis, Missouri. The company continued to expand its service purchasing two full-service travel agencies and a fleet of limos. 
Under the leadership of his two sons, Dale Strife and Dennis Strife, the company also operated 150 school buses and transported 4,000 school students throughout the greater Metro East area. In 1992, the school bus transportation business was sold and Vandalia Bus Lines focused on its expanding charter services. Leon passed away on December 23, 1996, leaving the care and management of the business to his family. Judy Strife began working with her husband, Leon, in 1972 when he started the school bus business and is still active in the operation of Vandalia Bus Line. He, my husband would always drive around this complex and he'd just look, you know, and he said to me, he says, you know, he says, someday I'm going to buy that company. And this was his dream. And it, it came true, 1975. And since then, we have grown from the four buses that we had earlier years to 65 plus now. So I kind of come in here and I watch it grow. And uh, uh, it just makes me proud to see where we've, where the kids have brought this company to. Dale Strife is the president of Vandalia Bus Lines and handles the day-to-day -day operation of the company. Our growth has been to increase our fleet every year, upgrade the equipment, put out a better product, uh, continue the technologies that they upgrade. Uh, we're competitive with everybody just because of the equipment we have. Not always the lowest price out there, but you know, the quality service speaks for itself. Dennis Strife is the vice president of the company and is also responsible for the day-to-day -day business of operating Vandalia Bus Line. Vandalia Bus Lines is celebrating 75 years of service. This is not something that every company can accomplish. I believe this milestone has been reached with Vandalia because of its hard, dedicated employees and because of its wonderful leadership. It was through the leadership of our father that has instilled hard work and good leadership in its current family members that operate the business today that we find it rewarding to provide quality service, and a wonderful experience for all of our customers. Roger Strife, Judy's third son, oversees the maintenance portion of the bus company and serves as a mechanic. Melissa is Leon and Judy's daughter and serves as the company's treasurer while also helping with the day-to-day -day duties of operating the company. Lori, the second daughter of Judy and Leon Strife, serves as the company's official bookkeeper and is active in sales and daily operations as well. Vandalia Bus Lines, with a staff of 120 dedicated employees, is committed to continuing the tradition handed down by Leon Strife of excellent services to its customers. Its fleet of 52 Van Hool and MCI motor coach buses and eight minibuses will travel over 2.2 million miles in 2007 the company continues to provide excellent shuttle, tour, and charter services throughout the Metro East Illinois and St. Louis and the nation. This bus company's proven record of success can be measured by the clients it serves. Vandalia Bus Lines is the exclusive motor coach transporter for the St. Louis Rams, St. Louis Cardinals, and most NFL, NHL, and MLB teams that visit St. Louis. Happy 75th birthday Vandalia Bus Lines.